Hey guys, Jimmy Vegas here, and I'm going to answer a real popular question that I get asked quite a bit, surprisingly, is what is asset flipping? Now, asset flipping, in its broadest sense, is a controversial method which people publish games on whichever platform. Uh, the classic example is something known as Unit Z. So if we go to the Asset Store in Unity, and you can do that by holding Control and pressing 9, or you can go to the Asset Store via the website, and you'll find, obviously, tons of assets, but things like Unit Z are complete projects which people will take and then just publish to claim as their own. Now, I say it's controversial because, theoretically, once you buy something from the Asset Store, the license is yours. However, publishing it as your own game is not so good, to be honest. It's very... It is pretty bad because I'm sure some of you guys may have heard of Jim Sterling. Jim Sterling comes down hard on these people and recently um, it has gone down a little but because of things like Steam Greenlight that was where asset flipping kind of ran rampant. Now don't feel afraid to use assets on the asset store by no means. These assets are always here to help you whether it's free or paid. But you just have to remember that if you decide to take some of these complete projects and claim them as your own, people are likely to find out because things like Unit Z are very popular and very well known. So if you go to the complete projects section, let's clear off the Unit Z there. You'll see there's loads of different projects that you can download, driving games, RPG games, shooting games, all sorts. The whole asset flipping thing is basically taking that and claiming it as your own. There are also smaller versions of asset flipping where you take tons of different assets from here, there, everywhere, throw them all together into a game, which doesn't really come together as a game itself. It's not exactly uh, relevant to each other. So you could have guns and then you'd have a swordsman and then you'd have some magic going on, all while claiming to be a first person shooter. If it's clear the assets don't really fit together, it's obvious that that's an asset flip as well. But as I say, don't be afraid to use these assets on the asset store. They're always here to help you, whether you use them just to simply get your game along or whether you put modifications into it, never feel afraid. So guys, I hope that answers that question. And if you've got any more burning questions, please, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching.